he said something to me. And I went, is this Shakira, right? And the fellow went, yeah, I am, actually. And I, I and then you look twice and you go, oh, I didn't see that. Oh. <laughs> we should all get matching hot water tattoos. We're called the Roofy Boys, aren't we? <laughs> R- Roof what? gigs and Roofy Girls. <laughs> Fucking non behavior that. And he's like, oh, no, no, no. So he flaps it, right? And he's like, no, no, it's not like that. I went, let me see the messages then. Let me see the messages then, right? So he gives me the messages, right? And to be fair to him, nothing bad yeah. in it, do you know what I mean? He's just being cheese messages in, and he just doesn't want to be a cunt, but he's just being just personable, being polite, right? Yeah. Yeah. But then she goes, she says something like, um, I knew you wouldn't recognize me though. And he said, to be fair, you've had a bit of a glow up since year seven, right? That's nonsense. <laughs> what about the lemon lime one? Lemon lime. No, it's a bit it's racial. Oh, is it? Yeah. Lemon, lime. <laughs> <laughs> now, there once was a lemon and lime who argued on... It's a big day, soon. Yeah. The big day. Are you looking yeah. forward to it? I am, yeah, yeah. I'm excited. I am. It's going to be a special occasion. Isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> You're not coming to win. I'm not allowed at the win. By Zoom. Why is Jamie allowed to win? Because he's a, have you seen, liar, have you liar, seen Jamie liar. when he's had a pint? <laughs> he's a fucking disgrace. Yeah, I've only been, I've, we've only, like, we've he only looks, lo- he has one pint and looks homeless. He's like fucking Barney from The Simpsons. It's fucking grim. <laughs> <laughs> he met my gran in the old that town dance. By all accounts, <laughs> by all accounts, he was quite a nonce. <laughs> No way. <laughs> <laughs> me and Adam, right? Me and Adam were going to bring escorts, right? Just. But then I thought, no, you can't just tacky on, you know, on your mates' yeah, when yeah. they understand. But would have been boss. Me and Adam got like proper, like high end escorts. Not like chill road ones. I mean, like fucking high end ones. And me and Adam just walked in with these like supermodels. Would have been sick, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would have been sick for about a minute until everyone went, why are you two with Escort? <laughs> <laughs> What's happening, everyone? Uh, thanks for downloading Hot Water's Green Room podcast. Before we kick off with today's fantastic episode, I just want to let you know how you can support the podcast. You can join up uh, as a YouTube member at Hot, Wa- Hot Water Comedy on YouTube. Sign up to be a podcast member for £3 a month. You get early access to the public episodes and a bonus episode each week. Not only that, you'll get access to all of the podcasts that are coming on the Hot Water Podcast Community Channel. It's going to be the place to come for podcasts in the Northwest. I hope you enjoy the episode. Thank you. Hello guys, welcome to Hot Water's Green Room Podcast with me host Tony Carroll and myself, Jamie Hutchinson. Today's special guest is... <laughs> Fuck, we're professional. What are you doing? We're you like cut them off though. Like, Fuck here lad, I didn't even tell you the outro. We know what no, we're doing. Why is he doing the intro though? Well, Julia, I no, know you did the intro. No, he, no I, listen. he says, he leaves a gap for me, he's going with myself, Jamie Hutchinson. And then oh, I go please. back. He's got a big opportunity here, and I feel like he's a fucking, you know. <laughs> Are you fucking joking, Will? I think you're trying to, like, get p- put a, a wedge in between us. I'm a big guest here. I think you're, I think you're trying to... I yeah. think you're trying to put a wedge he's in between us. He haven't had anyone on a mic calibre yet, and you're fucking <laughs> flapping a little I think you feel threatened, because we're the new Golden Boys of Hot Water's comedy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, guys, and welcome to Hot Water Green Room Podcast <laughs> with me, host, Tony Carroll. And myself, Jamie Hutchinson. Today's special guest is an OG Hot Water legend, the guy himself, Mr. Paul Smith, everyone. Yeah. Thanks, Tom. Thanks for having me. I, I really that's appreciate okay, that. mate. I'm a big fan. I know you've been trying to get on for ages, have, like email after email. Begging and begging. Yeah. Just keep waiting outside before you start. Because <laughs> this is... People turn up, you're like, there's no room, Paul. I've been sat in the back. I've been sat in the back every podcast. This is a few weeks delayed because it was meant to have Paul on a few weeks ago. And someone who won't be named got too pissed and couldn't make it. Wasn't me, because well, I'm, yeah. I'm, the, I'm the Lord's yeah, child. well, let's not say who it life. was. Let's not grass. All I'm saying is I got a message saying, lad... I've been doing some heavy stuff till 11 a.m. You're gonna have to carry this podcast, <laughs> and I still turned up. And then he fucking whoever it was didn't say enough. I know. 
I mean, you want your last warning, Binta. So I don't know. It's great. So we have you change everyone's plans. All right, mate. Good. Sad. Very good. Just fresh back from your stag do, middle of a tour. I'm just, well, I feel all right today. I've been having a fucking bit of a nasty one this week. Like, yeah. to Encanto all week, like a fucking nutter. Uh, you've been what? Crying to the Encanto soundtrack. <laughs> Encanto. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, like emotional. How long does it take you to get over it? Hang over. Yeah, but I f- well, I don't know because I went to UFC. I didn't bevy or nothing, but I was just didn't get to fucking just chill. So you went months. You went Tuesday to went Friday. To, yeah, Tuesday to Friday morning. And then morning. the UFC Saturday. Come, drove back to Friday. Ooh, didn't want to slept and then got up early and went to UFC. Fuck that. Right, too soon. I um, I, but I was happy I was there when I was there, but like I could have been not there. Do you know what I mean? Because it was it was Cheltenham last week, so yeah. I, I went on the. It's like Christmas Day for my family, Gold Cup Day. So we all went out on the piss and me and my uncle Simon got on it till fucking 10 in the morning. And I had to pull a gig at night because my voice had gone. Yeah. Because it's just fucking, it's just too soon after the uh, after the car crash. You don't get back in the car straight away, do you? <laughs> need a bit of rehab. <laughs> so I needed a bit of a, a, bit of a chill You're time. You're looking fresh though, too. Thank you, mate. I've, you know what? I've just, I've, I think I've like, like, sometimes every like, Three, four times a year, little like little voice you know, in my head. Little health kick and start yeah. walking and that. Little, yeah, little voice, <laughs> little walking, voice in my head says, "Come on, start you're walking. gonna die soon. Do something." <laughs> and it, 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 it comes starts to raising me. money for charity, isn't it? Yeah, that's good. It's a nice oh, thing to do. Good. Yeah. It's nice to give Get back. Get you motivated as well, does. doesn't it? That's what it is. You know what I mean? Don't get me wrong. I'm a nice guy as well. You know, I'm not just doing it just for me. No, but, but it's a win-win, isn't it? It's a win-win. Yeah, you get to raise money for the boss charity, and also you put yourself out there. You don't want to let people down. So then you've yeah. got to stick to your goals. It's yeah. a win-win. Oh fuck charity! So guess what I'm going to do next? I'm going to get in the ring for charity. I've decided. Are you fighting? I don't know. You've been trying to do that for a while. When you were supposed to fight Daddy Matthews at one point? Yeah. Fuck off. Yeah. It was. It was yeah. So yeah. Club and call Daddy Matthews. <laughs> called him out on. He went training for him. I called him out on Twitter. And he actually replied. Yeah. I was oh, like dude, fuck. Yeah. <laughs> he, 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 he ended up winning. He ended up winning this fight that he wasn't meant to win, and then went on some big mad winning streak and won a title again. So luckily enough, that happened. Otherwise, he would have just bladdered me. Tell <laughs> 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 me that. And lad, he said to me as well, "I'm gonna punch your fat head." <laughs> <laughs> did you not take it as a joke? Out, no, no, he nah, did. Nah, but nah, oh, thinking oh, for so us, I'm still gonna punch your fat head. <laughs> yeah, nah, I was just telling eyes on Twitter, wasn't I? It's funny though. Do you get the ring? Do you do a lot of? No, I get up. No, what? I, do, I go through a little fucking month period every year where I, I think it's like January time and everyone thinks oh, I need to get fucking fit for the summer. I need the goal and everyone's fucking. I'm like about hundred people's marathon. Do you know what I mean? Everyone goes because because I, I I like to hit pads and that. Yeah. Like, yeah, like, yeah. I, I, the war coming. Well, like, yeah, so I start face. getting it back and I talk for a living, do you know what I mean? I can't yeah. start losing words, and that. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to get punched in the head. I have a fucking weird... Re- you know what? I have a mad reaction to getting punched in the head. It happened... It, it, <laughs> you know, like, sometimes you're doing pads and you, you, you roll and you just go the wrong way and you fucking... I, I just got clocked in the jaw and I just start laughing. And he was like, that's weird. <laughs> the lad who's saying it. I was like, I, if I get it in the face, I just laugh, which is a terrible fucking thing. Yeah, because you look. It looks like that didn't even. No, because yeah, for looking bossing a fight though, wouldn't it? Go, yeah, 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 yeah. It looked bossing a fight though. It Kids would. just watching you, just yours go. <laughs> yeah, but then he hits you again, and you fucking crying. Because <laughs> 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 fucking Milo done it to the V. No Troy or yeah, yeah. Mm. You see him fight to the V. Oh, oh yeah, I yeah, didn't. He's, he's, he's a good boxer. Yeah, yeah. yeah, he got absolutely tuned out. Like. Yeah, come on. Because you got to put in against the kid who was a fucking boxer, do you know what I mean? Yeah. And I think the kid was like, "All right, I'll just go easy," because it's like. Because he, he he was boxing as Troy Hawk, oh, and I yeah. think the kid was like, "All right, I was just like." And then because Troy was actually good. Well, no, because Troy fucking there uh, put him out in the first <laughs> round of fucking heavy left hook. Did he? Yeah. And uh, uh, Ma- yeah. Milo or Troy said to me, yeah. I, he went, I, "I hit him with this thing," and I thought, you know, when you go, oh, "I've hit him too hard there," and he, he said, "I seen this kid go." Oh, are we doing that? Are we? And oh, I was like, oh. No. But if it, I was like, that could have been in your head though, and that's what made you lose because you've got you've shit yourself on that yeah, tackle. Yeah, yeah. Gone, ah, fucking. I'm just hit some harder again, shouldn't he? He got proper like fucking. Grind out. Legs went out from underneath when everything's a fucking flop, yeah. I, I had a bad experience bad. That playing, playing dead arm in school. <laughs> <laughs> and so, like, you think it's all friendly and that. And then she hits you back. <laughs> she hits you back. back. <laughs> you <fucking laughs> but you can't show you're hurting because it's a girl who you fancy. <laughs> <laughs> fucking mood that would be me with my bed <laughs> <laughs> oh, fucking you so I hate playing that out because I've got long thin arms do you know what I mean so it goes right to the bone because I've got no like peas you said in. you got long thin arms Jimmy I've got long yeah. thin arms oh, oh yeah I still feel like like Mr Tuckle Mr Tickle and short fat legs like a little <laughs> orangutan 
<laughs> Good confection. You don't know what's coming because no. I've I've got the the squat and the reach. Maybe you should I wrestle. Could, I could bo- I could box someone's head off by just staying behind my jab. <laughs> don't, don't know. The reach. Have you got no reach? I have. Look, look how long that arm is. How long is your arm? Longer than your arm. Yeah, but you're taller. Yeah, but so you couldn't box me up, could you? Yeah, I won't fight you. Fight someone else. <laughs> <laughs> fight someone smaller. <laughs> I'd, I'd, I'd fight Adam Stone. <laughs> Again, name is him. I reckon Stone would be fucking solid on this line, you know. Yeah, Do you reckon? Yeah, yeah. I reckon he like Brad Pitt and snatch and he takes his top off and that. <laughs> you seen him? He's fucking hench when he takes yeah, his top he off. He just does yeah. pull up in the house like a fucking nutter. Yeah. He does what? He does. He like proper gym, like prison trains, doesn't he? <laughs> just yeah. fucking does press ups and pull ups in his house with his little fuck with like his fingers and that because he's dead light. <laughs> I'm, I'm got little traps on him and that. Yeah. I reckon he's on the juice on this line, mate. Are you, um, are you back, back on the tour now? Nah, I just finished. Just finished it all together, yeah? Booked in, yeah. Nice. How was it? Good. Better. Yeah. It was well. the best one you've done? Yeah, easy. yeah. Just get better now every every time. Yeah, you and I want to play them big rooms. Now. Yeah, yeah. I'm getting, used to, like, I'm getting used to building shows for those big Has rooms. Has it been filmed in that, yeah? Yeah, yeah, filmed it in Dublin. Nice. So it's going to go out soon, I think. Nice. And when you're back on, so... Te- well, we've got two shows left on this tour, technically, which is July 15th and 16th in Glasgow. Um, but they're so far away. But the close to the we- other tour. We've we got postponed yeah, yeah. and postponed, and it's yeah, the only yeah. dates we could get because it's a dead busy theatre. So by the time we get to it, I'm going to have to have the new show ready anyway because it's yeah. got to be done for uh, September. So I was like, Fuck, that's a quick that. turnaround for a tour. I know, but the thing is, like the last tour I was, I had for like two years, so I was still doing. So I've got about half it done already. Yeah. And I like oh, to so are you so are you halfway through your your, your new one? I've got about half of it yeah. done and ready to go, and then. But I've got like me start like we're just being on me stag, but I've got the wedding and the honeymoon and all that. Yeah, so, yeah. So, so just happen. chilling. There. Yeah. Get that out, just man, man. And then are you just gonna are you just gonna are you just gonna gig for now then in hot water? Yeah, yeah. Around, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Just, 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 yeah, yeah. I only gig here, don't I? Yeah, yeah, too. Yeah. Yeah. Doing any whips. Cut you, cut you and you bruises. bleed hot water, baby. <laughs> 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 like you, like you, boy. <laughs> we should all get mashing hot water tattoos. <laughs> We're called the Roofy Boys, aren't we? <laughs> Ro- roof what? gigs and roofy girls. <laughs> I was, I was, I was, I was, I was, I was, I was dreading you saying that. You know? <laughs> we've got a no, we've got a no context account now as well. Well, no, some of the fucking. So what's made the no context like, account? No context. Hot water, hot water, green room podcast, yeah. no context. Yeah, so they just take a little things what we're saying and. But it sounds so he it, could just go and be roofy girls. Yeah, and just put, so put his face on. That's what he's. That's exactly what he's going to do now. Thanks, Paul. <laughs> yeah. Cheers for that. He might put my. He might do it to me though. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> the out of context clips sound better than when they're in context because we've got away with murder on some of the fucking yeah, we have to be behind sure, the yeah. paywall stuff on the oh, membership yeah. if you're not signed up for a quid a month to hear some. How many? How many members have you? Uh, got still over 500, isn't it? 500, yeah. yeah. Is it right? Sweet, isn't okay. it? Got a name for what are they called? Green Room. They're called a the Green Army. Army. Green Room Army. Green Army, do you remember the Green Army advert? Green Army. Green Army. Uh-huh. Do do that? You don't remember, you're not onto Green Army? No. Uh-huh. I you do. remember, what is it I for don't... Green Flag? I don't feel like it's green only flag. does, but he's a Green, green Army. Green Army. Green Army. Sell from Norwich. Aviva or Green Flag. Oh, no, like RAC. Yeah, yeah, but Green Flag, Green Army. How's the fella from Norwich, you want to? Or wherever he's oh, from. Plymouth. Plymouth, maybe. Yeah, yeah Plymouth, Argyle, it was, fucking yeah. fucking nonce places. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are you a fan? <laughs> of Green Army. Of the Green Room Army. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you, <laughs> have you listened or watched any podcasts, Paul? What? Have you listened to any of our podcasts or watched any? <laughs> no, it's okay. At least you're honest. Nah. We like our fans, I'm to be honest. I have to listen to podcasts. Oh, you have now, mate. I haven't. You've fucking got loads of time now. I listen to a bit of Rogan if I... Oh, is that, is that your go to, is it? Yeah. Still? But I'm dead he's, he's fell off a little bit since yeah. he moved to Spotify, hasn't he? I don't. I, yeah, that little intro thing does me then. I just I just think he, his guests have fell off a little bit as well. I used to love, like, just being fucking. Like, just like, it, I like all the scientists, mate. Just yeah, I, I like it. when he gets comedians on. Yeah, I like it when he's, like, got a fella who's, who's been, like, in the Amazon for, like, yeah, three years. That's what I like, yeah. Sick, you know what I mean? It's just weird because he just nods along and goes, right. Yeah, do you know what I mean? Doesn't matter in a bit. Like he, he, you don't know what the guy's saying. Yeah. I He's think he pull that up, Jamie. Pull that up. I think he's just <laughs> guest loads like someone here. Yeah? Eh? What? <laughs> <laughs> what? What is it? 
Oh. What goes into running a successful podcast like this? <laughs> if you find out, let us know. What's in the, what's in, <laughs> what's in the prep? Um, Basically, we what have you done today? Thinking I've got Paul Smith. Yeah. We're not like others, you see. So this is we want you to feel comfortable. <laughs> you know what I, mean? I, I watch, I watch all the guests like content and stuff just to freshen me. You know, because I know you inside out, mm. upside down, back to front. <laughs> so I know you. I told you you wouldn't be able to be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> Laurie's in. Sorry, Laurie's, Laurie's in behind the camera. Yes. She can't Sorry. fucking shut up for ten minutes. <laughs> <laughs> it, it took her twelve minutes to. Uh, so I, I do a bit of. <laughs> well, I'll call it prep. I just watch like stand up clips and stuff just to freshen up. Mm. So, I was watching... what's your favorite one of mine? Um, that was a good one. But we said it on the podcast a few weeks ago. Do you remember the Hell Valley yeah, story? Yeah, we've been talking nice things about you, Paul. About the yogurt. When Callum said, You've got to take out the chewed yogurt up Hell Valley. Mm. And you told it on your podcast. Oh, yeah. We talked about that the other week. We've been talking nice things about you, mate. Have you? Yeah, we have. Right. Yeah. Thanks, mate. Well, you know, because we're the two new hot water, <laughs> hot water golden boys, you know what I mean? You know, we like to speak about uh, the past golden boys. Yeah, ginger one and a, ginger one and a fat one. They know how the they know how the method works. <laughs> <laughs> they couldn't find it both together. They split it into two. <laughs> no, you and I'm Adam Brown. And Eve yeah. Sale. Oh, no. Eve Sale. Don't be Adam Brown. Fume with Adam Rowe. What? Didn't get me a birthday present. What? I didn't even I know, but I got Adam Rowe two pairs of Boss Hey, Adam, you're a fucking scumbag, Heavy mate. That, isn't it? Heavy. I haven't, even, I haven't even said it to him because I thought. Yeah, don't. Bring it up, but I'm going to talk about it on podcast. <laughs> do you, think Sorry, do you gonna honestly think he's going to watch ours? Nah, we but other people cancel. will. And then tell and him. It'll yeah. just. Festa that's, like a that's little, what people one, like. One little maggot in the room. Oh, that in happened, the room that that happened just with Rob Thomas. Oh, obviously. Like, why are we having to go at Adam Rowe <laughs> with the comments? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking pussies. <laughs> Thanks for watching, though. But yeah, I, 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 Rob Thomas got it. So if you sag Adam off, the fucking. His fans just fucking jump on it. Well, I'm not slagging him off. I'm just saying. Yeah, well, it'd be nice to get a bit of I'm slagging him off. <laughs> Is it your 40th? Yeah. Fuck off. Uh-huh. You're not 40. Uh-huh. 40 last week. Fuck, you look great for 40. Okay, mate. thank you, mate. I look fucking. Turkey's I amazing. Put, hey, Paul looks younger than you, lad. <laughs> I know, mate. <laughs> I, know. I, know. I took a picture before and he went down the ladder and I went, who's the dad? It's fucking you, Hutchie. I'm sorry, mate. I've got a. I've got a well, dad bods are in, aren't they? Yeah, but. I'm creepy uncle bod. I'm going for like Nancy little don't babysit me. Last <laughs> last on the babysit list if it's an absolute must. Go around Uncle James. <laughs> yeah, I'm going for the uh, the creepy uncle vibe. Are you gonna not try are you gonna try not drink now then till the wedding? Oh, yeah, I can't do it anymore. And then the wedding. Oh are we yeah. getting pissed the or what? going off. I can't wait to go. Hey, we've got a proper uh, fucking, I was proper looking to get a proper actually. Ibiza fucking Bongo fucking, <laughs> she's gone full on. We'll have fire yes, breathers and shit at the fit. Oh, yes, I can't wait. It actually looks a really nice place, doesn't it? That's sick. It's like, like it looks like it's a like broad. private cove, yeah. Yeah. It's mad. Don't it? Yeah, so it's going to be It's gonna be amazing. Torquay's on two levels, isn't it? Hmm. There's two Torquay's, isn't there? No. There's an upstairs Torquay and a downstairs Torquay, isn't there? <laughs> I did a gig there and I was on the upstairs bit, on the wrong, like... And the gig no, was think that's you, just called a hill that you know. I think that's just called. I think that's, <laughs> I think that's just called a pub that you're gigging in. <laughs> There's an upstairs and downstairs. Talking. Where did you go? Where were you doing your gig? Revolution. That's thing. That's right on the water. Yeah, that's on the downstairs. I was on the upstairs. Like the you know, like Edinburgh's got an Edinburgh and an Edinburgh. Do you know I, I mean? feel like you you've remembered this, man. You know. Because I had Google Possibly, Maps yeah. on. Uh, well, <laughs> <laughs> behind the paywall. Uh, <laughs> um, there's an up. There's like a, a city and below a city. Nah, there's not. You there know. is. I swear. To, I swear down. I've been there. Because I've, 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 I've been once. No, it's hilly. You've been yeah, once. That's what I mean. Yeah. But there's a town. <laughs> there's a top level. There's oh not. My it's God. Torquay Town Centre, and it's about that big. It's like height and village, and then. Yeah, but I when I went from my hotel to my gig on like maps, it said you've arrived, and it was it I was uh, like a floor above. Do you know what I mean? Yes, but there's like because it's on a cause it's on a big hill. There's cliffs in there, but there's no town up there. <laughs> there is a <laughs> it's not, t- love. Oh my god! 
Let me try and Google Torquay. <laughs> There's a fucking upstairs in Torquay, mate. Look, hey, if, Someone's hey, fucking if, if this is the thing that makes his head fall off. I know, yeah. <laughs> After everything he's done, it's like, this is the thing so, that twists his head off Torquay. and he ends up in fucking what would you call sectioned it? off it. Because someone in the revolution said you're upstairs. I was in upstairs, Torquay! <laughs> <laughs> Torquay is part of Devon. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking <laughs> Richard Osman here flying. <laughs> oh, I, don't, I don't know how to articulate what I mean. It's, yeah, Seven Hills of Torquay. Is Torquay rough? Um, is Torquay rough? <laughs> <laughs> I went round um, asking for Beak in Torquay after my gig had been on. Been hard, though. No, there was none. What? No. Mate, they thought oh. you were busy then. No, <laughs> just just loads yeah, yeah. in Tokyo. <laughs> nah, not where I was. Not good though. Not, not, in, down, not in downstairs Tokyo. You need to go upstairs to the toilet. Upstairs Tokyo. Do you this? is upstairs, yeah. lad. <laughs> oh, me. got manners down here. Yeah, it was heavy, that fucking long New Year's Eve gig in Tokyo. In Revolution? Revolution? Yeah. Where's Revolution? Yeah, yeah, that's right. That, yeah. Where the fuck have they done a gig in here? Yeah, they, they set out nice. It was like Rob Riley did it, so yeah. he set out like. Did decent. you ever have any mad gigs where you had to travel like far? No, I've had mad gigs with you though, where we fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Which ones? <laughs> the OG Every days. Ones. Remember them Christmas gigs you put on in the Mons? Oh my god! You put, you put, oh mate, you put these Christmas gigs on in the Mons, like this pub in fucking Bootle. I thought you said for Mons. Then. No, well, I swear well, to well, <laughs> that's why it's called that. Let's do the full segue, right? <laughs> No one in it. This woman paid us money as well. Like, decent so money, wasn't it? He was just like, we'll just do it. It's going to be shit. Crimbo, we'll get money in for Grimbo. And yeah. I was like, Sand, I'll do it. Yeah. So he goes down, and it's fucking these two fellas at the bar just fucking sat there fuming that we were talking. <laughs> And it just gets like trying to shut him up. And he was like, mate, I'm, doing, I'm trying to do comedy. And don't, you don't use like jokes. And you were like, hey, we do like jokes, like, but you're not telling any jokes. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking heavy. Oh, I know mate, you were just that, thinking about that, it. Now, this is like 10 seconds in. And it, you know, when you sat there going, oh, I've got to go. Oh, this is no. heavy, right? We just decided just to do half an hour each, didn't we? Yeah, that was just get up and just yeah. half an hour. Oh, so then I get. But the money was boss, lad. Like, really good, lad. <laughs> you just got there, aren't you? Mate, so I got oh. up. And fucking, I'd been like, no one was listening to me, and everyone was fucking pissed off because they just wanted to have a bevy. And then <sighs> this fella walked out, <laughs> the standard line, fucking, th- this fella walked out near a bean, and he walked right across the front of the stage, these two fellas. And I was on stage, and I was like, didn't know, I, I had nothing, I had nothing left, and I was like, what the fuck? And it's just like, you know how disrespectful that is, and I was got for you. I went, fucking hell, mate. Um, he'd be a bit quieter like that, and he, he said something to me. And I went, is this your care, right? And the fellow went, yeah, I am, actually. And I, I knew when you look twice and you go, oh, no, I didn't see that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and, and he was just seeing him in the back going, oh. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, oh, mate, I'm so sorry. Oh. Get him. Didn't any of them, was any of them funny or not? I think, I think we got any, I think we got there in the end and we made something yeah. out of it. I don't bad because we don't free, free, sold me. our souls to the devil. That's oh, what we, we don't free, and by the third one, it, yeah. it was shit, but it was it, it was, was a funny game. shit. Oh, it returned. Oh yeah. Mate, she, oh, she, oh, she, she loves it. She loves it. Oh my god. She was made up and just giving us time. We were like, mate, she want us back next week. She was like, yeah, I was like, she weren't even in there though. She was just she like yes. She just pop her head out with the fucking roast dinners like that. Oh. Go, on, oh, go on, lads, keep going, will you? Bad girl. Go on. Oh. Me and Paul just dying on our ass for fucking 200 quid. Do it, though, don't you? You just think, oh, oh God. Just you like know, a... when, you, when you just reminded me that there, lad, I fucking yeah. cringed oh. then. I was like, oh. oh it's, 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 it's selling your soul to the devil, though, gigs. Yeah. You know? Yeah. 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 I did one in Reading. I just spent all mine on Ale anyway. I did, I did one in Reading. I, I just paddled. I'm just dying on my ass. Do you know what I mean? Just nothing. I, you're like cold sweat. I'm trying to act confident. And I'm inside. I'm melting inside. I said, oh, what, what, one more pit to wrap up on. And I went, oh, I didn't get, didn't get picked for the school football team. And someone went, oh, no way. Tell us more. <laughs> but, oh. <laughs> So, so I had That's to, hilarious. So, so I had to play rugby, right? <laughs> and just die. Oh, oh melting inside on my birthday as well. Oh, Dying on my ass. For? 150. Nah, well, that's, I would. Yeah. I'd still do it now. I'd die on my ass 150. But Red. I like dying on my ass now. I think it's after the mods gigs. <laughs> <laughs> I actually enjoy it. Yeah, I know what you mean. Oh, it's me. <laughs> 
the worst yeah. happened, didn't it? You just go after The worst has fucking happened, yeah. mate, to tell you. We, I did one at Crimbo. Yeah. You, you were there. That yeah. gig that you came and watched. Why is it always me? No, you were oh. in the you, you know when you come in with your mates and you sat at the back and it was it was it was half like quiet quiet gig. Oh yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. Um, yeah. and it was just full of a couple of big groups at Christmas and I yeah. just I just yeah. talked about getting pegged by my bed yeah. just to do Lads, the that was hilarious. And the, the after fellas in there were just fucking fuming. What, yeah. And then after yeah. in the club, yeah. yeah. And after people and I just kept making it work. <laughs> it, was like, it was like it was like close to Crimbo, <laughs> but like it was, yeah. it was like a studio. All like, these half fellas didn't have a fucking clue. It's like big groups one like yeah. Crimbo dudes, but they just like just weren't right for it, you know what I mean? Just one of them gigs where you just you can't get yeah. anything out of it. And, so and then he's just fucking after like two minutes thought watch this and I swear <laughs> man I had tears I was so only doing low, it for him no yeah lad oh, was <laughs> four, man, getting pegged by his beard with these two fellas with the beards and I just looking at him <laughs> and he couldn't look at him and he was I'm, I'm clocking that I'm clocking him and I'm just crying my eyes on that bit I, you know what though right yeah. I do that bit in my tour show right Mate, it's fucking boss like 2000 yes. people it goes off that bit. Yeah, it's they fucking boss. Love it. When you're in a room with about 50 people, yeah, it's, it's, don't yeah, laugh at it. It's, it's too full like, on, isn't it? It's, oh, it's too into it, isn't it? It's too much. Yeah. It's too low speed. It's it's because you, you you're there. You're in yeah. smelling distance. Yeah. You know what I mean? They can feel it. Yeah, oh. definitely. But this it is funny dying dying on your ass in front of a mate though, isn't it? Yeah, it's boss. Fucking sick. We used to we used to we used to we used to years ago, didn't we? Like like when we first started off, if it was a quiet gig or there was. You know what? He was not on riding on it. You just, you just, we just mess around with you like yeah, that. Or you, yeah. or you, 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 we used to play games like we'd say to someone, say, say this in yeah, your set and that. Say I had to sing once the hand rounds. <laughs> Remember that? Yeah. I think I just started doing it anyway. <laughs> but like, you just say like, someone would go to me, Tony, but you wouldn't sing a song and just in the middle of your set. <laughs> yeah, no reference. Um, yeah, no reference. <laughs> at all. I just yeah. would. Yeah, it's class. That, I class. had to go on once. The, I had to, you just said you have to go on. You can't do crowd work and you can't be funny. <laughs> just, 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 <laughs> just literally have to sense just matter of fact talk about what's happened that day yeah just like from from waking up just tell her what you had for your breakfast and that you can't even try and be funny do you know when you did that open weird. mic in berlin yeah that was that oh shit that was that. yeah and you well, all you well, all made you, me get up you smashed it though no but the thing is you're still laughing at me because it was so weird that they thought it must have been a fucking thing like oh, a flag flag and I was like yeah yeah <laughs> and then they were still done it and then fucking yeah, Freddie Quinn goes on and does his fucking material oh, no, yeah. and <laughs> dies on his ass nah he done he done oh, well. no because it was a fucking like a proper old, new material he's gone on and done his fucking it, the only gig I've ever seen him do good at right I'm going to do a metaphor that was good, that was really good. Oh, oh, I'm crossing the line. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you should just do the whole podcast like that, you know. Oh, do you for the members when we just say, I've got, uh, Jamie's not well today, we've got, we've got, we've got, got a friend Will you do the whole hour like that? <laughs> yeah, so I'll do it on the next one. You wouldn't? One. I'll, I'll, I'll do it on the next one. Coerce, yeah. I'll do it on the next one. On the me- next member special, so yeah. tune in to see that, £3 yeah. a month. We'll get Freddie sign up because he'll be furious. <laughs> <laughs> get Freddie in as a guest and just talk to him like that and see how long it takes him to get off. Imitation is the highest form. <laughs> 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 oh fucking hell! Yeah. It's not on better than this side of Freddie. <laughs> fucking brilliant. Yeah. Did you see? Have you seen the picture in the green room? Not hot water's green room, like the uh, so uh, so hot water's green room. Yeah, hot water. Yeah. Hot water's <laughs> other green room. There's a picture. You, know, you know that dead famous video of that nonsense? Huh? You know they like the oh yeah yeah, yeah. Goes, oh, oh yeah 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 I shouldn't say this, fuck oh, he's not going to watch it anyway, is he? No, probably so, not. So, Freddy, right, has got this fucking, he's a bit of a crab, isn't he? Like, <laughs> and he'd, he'd got a message off this bird, like he was in the front row, and she'd messaged him, and gone, um, ah, oh, you used to, uh, it's mad seeing you, you won't remember me, but you used to teach me in year seven, right? Because he used to be a teacher, didn't yeah. he? Yeah. And I was like, oh. And so I'm joking around going, fucking hell, Freddie, what have you done here, right? And I was like, fucking nonce behaviour that. And he's like, oh, no, no, no. So he flaps it, right? And he's like, no, no, it's not like that. I went, let me see the messages then. Let me see the messages then, right? So he gives me the messages, right? And to refer to him, nothing bad yeah. in it, do you know what I mean? He's just being cheese messages in, and he just doesn't want to be a cunt, but he's just being just personable, being polite, right? Yeah. Yeah. But then she goes, she says something like, um, I knew you wouldn't recognise me, though. And he said, to be fair, you've had a bit of a glow-up since year seven, right? <laughs> 
That's nonsense. <laughs> well, if, I don't think you meant it that way, but I went, eee, a fucking rat. So I was giving the loads of shit, but it was me, Ro, and Danny Mack in the green room. So yeah. I went, lads, get on this, right? So his head fell off like he was fucking fuming. And he was like, nah, I'm not having this, lads, because fucking, like, I haven't done nothing. Like, you know what I meant by that? You know what I meant by that? He's gone fucking mad, right? And he's going, <laughs> he's like, it's fucking, you know what? I'm trying to, I'm, I'm comparing the shows and I'm trying to relax between the shows, I mean, and, and I just thank you because you've ruined me break. <laughs> <laughs> so we're all screaming, right? And then fucking, he goes off in the back and Row comes out and he's got that picture printed that way. Thank you! You're my break! He's stuck it up on the wall and he's like, oh, fuck this! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh fucking great, you know. He's funny. He hates yeah. it, lad. He's he his head goes, yeah, like, his head oh, goes. Because yeah. the well, thing about Freddy is he takes about half an hour to finish his story. <laughs> yeah. So you just keep interrupting him. <laughs> <laughs> and then he, but he won't, he can't let it go. He can't let the story go. So he just keeps got the chat. He, he, he just stops it. Oh. It's like you put him on pause and he just goes. <laughs> and then starts <laughs> laughing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Proper <laughs> scenic <laughs> route, innit? <laughs> yeah. Oh. I was love you, really, Freddy. I'm get... only messing with you. Me. Yeah, we love you, Freddy. I think he's gonna. Fuck we me. love you for all the wrong reasons. Though. Gonna start. Stop this. Gonna start roasting next people. Stop. Gonna start roasting <laughs> me on his fucking dead man talking podcast or whatever it is. That's why he keeps changing his name every six months. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Not more names than Jason Bourne. That con. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you can't think of a pro evo. We do pro evo. You know, if we're slagging someone off. Yeah. So, so like. Eve Sale for Adam Rowe or whatever. Do you know like what I mean? a fake name. Like, oh, yeah. That, that, yeah right, because yeah. Freddie just oh, okay, yeah. has so many fucking <laughs> fake names. Just call him Daniel Levo. <laughs> 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 if anyone from Ofsted watching. <laughs> He's not a teacher anymore, is he? Boy? No. I wonder why. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You've ruined my career. <laughs> <laughs> I can't breathe. I need air. <laughs> God bless him. When's your next show then in the Hot Water Comedy Club? Tonight, mate. Tonight, back uh, Well, uh, when did this go out? So this will be out. Oh, uh, if we got in the bank, O'Shea, yeah. uh, Glado. Did you get O'Shea on, yeah? Yeah, That's yeah. It's it's oh, gl- yeah he was sick. Good guess on it. He's got, he was uh, thinking about putting a live show on of this and he said he might might come down and do a bit of stand-up. Yeah, yeah. I was seeing these stand-up, yeah. 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 Five minutes, only, yeah. Only, to, only for us, like, yeah. you know what I mean? Only for the members. The members. I hope every punchline. I had the shit on a shot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mate, you talking about that was great, wasn't it? Yeah. You used to watch all of Bow Rap and that, didn't you? Yeah, I loved yeah. it. We all used to love it, didn't we? Yeah, we did, yeah. But mm. it's the same, you talking about it, it all fell off, didn't it? It all went shite. Yeah, that don't flop went mad, didn't it? Went yeah. fucking YouTube advertising went west. Yeah, that's what I mean. Oh, fell apart. I think there was all m- six mates. I think there was media with paying acts as well, weren't there? Yeah. Mm. Just because like all the money stopped, didn't it? Uh, yeah. Rap behaviour, mate. Mm. Some. Promoters like that on fucking circuit, mate. You are know you, who are you are. Has everyone been in Spiky Micah? Apart from Leek in June. Yeah. <laughs> I think we give it till June. <laughs> eh? I mean, I'd been him off if I'd ever done a gig for him. But, I mean, for like... When, when I'm in it, when, for, I, when I'm in Spiky like Mike. show purposes, don't um, fuck yourself, Spiky Mike, I'll never do a gig for you. Yeah, fuck you, Spiky Mike. I don't even know yeah. you. Yeah, and after and after the second he? of June, Spiky Mike. He's a fucking promoter. He made a Hillsborough joke on like. Oh, was that him who made this? Fucked you today. And then deleted it. And everyone's like, I get what people are saying. Everyone's made offensive jokes, but still. Yeah, yeah so but he's just don't talk about me. He's, he's fifty-five and wears an Hot Wheels shirt. How can you take him serious? Do you know what I mean? No, I don't. I, don't, I mean, I, I've, it. He's a cunt. Yeah. Right. I yeah. mean, I already thought he was a cunt before that, so it's just... Yeah, yeah and as soon as midnight, 3rd of June, mate, you're dead to me. <laughs> <laughs> as well. But I'm still doing leak. Just, <laughs> hey, get your feet and slap them. <laughs> 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 and there will be a leak in your roof when it comes off after 20 minutes of Hutchinson for the last time. Unless you want to give or me Or there a will sp- be a leak in your... I haven't seen you for ages. Do you like your setting, man? I love your stuff. I do. Flames. Hey, you that? The guy is fucking. Listen, I've heard these flames. He was always flames, though, wasn't he? Yeah, but no, since he's been hanging out with me. Oh, oh, is hey, it? Yeah, glow up. I'd be glow up like that. Give him a few yeah, tips. Seven kids. Here and there. Change that. Do this. Fuck off. Roof off. Oh, Come yeah. on. And oh, exclusive. I'm still doing the well. same 20 from five years ago. <laughs> still well, one of 20, though. Still doing the joke I wrote. Which one? The football one. Yeah. Yes. But I've been, I've been there now. 
Aww. It's been too long, hasn't it? It's got, a cha- got a change now, haven't I? I but I'm going to keep the uh, the kidnap one. Yeah, that's the best. I have to it. keep that. I'll just come over and I will let that go. It's the thing is, because I want it to know, happen, you know, maybe. Be, it's still doing beans on toast. No, that's well done, <laughs> that, mate. Beans well on toast. The fire, yeah, character's gone, mate. He's gone. He's well groomed. I'm going to do a chippy set. No, on the retire it, mate. Yeah. yeah. You've just got to... Uh, don't fit in my stuff now. You're yeah, because I know when I, last time I seen you, your old stuff was in a... Like, it was a different character. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you, so change, you, you were talking different in your new stuff. I prefer that. this persona. Yeah. Have, well, do you, you know. find it, do, you, do you find it hard to, to write the new stuff? I know you, you write shows and that as well, don't you? So you, you've always, write, you've always... Not right, but you've always been good at... I I I, I come up with shows. As you get, as you get yeah, see, like, I think because I've always been in and out as well, and I'm a lazy. I cunt. remember trying to trying to write a twenty, and having a good ten and trying to write a twenty, and couldn't. It took me about a year to get that yeah. ten minutes because and it still weren't that good. Because I was, cause you're just not right. You don't know what your voice is, and I know that sounds like cliche, but yeah. you just don't know. Fucking, you're trying to write and trying to think what they're gonna like. Yeah, fucking yeah. Dead and you're talking weird and so forth. I know that's exactly that's exactly what I've. I'm in, I'm in that limbo right now. Yeah. So I write new, new set. I can't remember any of it. My best jokes I ever wrote have been while I'm on stage freestyling it. So yeah. like, it's just like, why not just get the bollocks to go on and stop thinking about me? I've said that laugh. to you for I years. Know. That's I what know. I was trying to say to you for years. Remember when we were fucking writing that show? <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, because he's got loads of good stories and he, he, put, yeah. a, he put a show on. A solo show and sold it sold loads of tickets yeah. and he was like, "Lad, I haven't got a show." I've got about fifteen minutes of and stuff. So we're all sat there going, "Oh, lad, oh, so, we're fucking, so we're just like, lad, you're gonna have to get on." So what do we talk about? Like we're talking about festival. you. We're talking about your mom disappearing, but then it turned out your mom was little Kim. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then his mum was little kid, and that's what Tupac and Biggie was fighting over because he so, didn't know who the dad I basically, was. Basically, my mum, my mum was the cause of murder and Tupac. And Biggie. <laughs> so but lad, it made sense, didn't it? That's so funny. Lad, it made sense. Yeah. Little Kim could have been Can't my mum. Can't remember none of it. Oh, so genius stuff. Yeah. And then you and, and another story about you, you may fucking ride into France on a scooter. Yeah, while he's sitting there with his yeah. bed, oh. and then that tied into it somehow, and then. He, <laughs> <laughs> when you come on as Bart Simpson, yeah, I don't do anything. I just spike it up. Because Paul Blair went, "Hey, a day it's to just go on as Bart, Bart Simpson." But you're not. Dre- he wasn't dressed as Bart Simpson. <laughs> just, yeah. He just I, spiked his head up. He didn't have a skate. Uh, uh, all he could say was, "Don't have a cow, man." <laughs> And no one other can. I caramba! Oh, everyone was just looking at like, him. Oh, I mean, just died to death. Yeah. yeah. Everyone just looked at him like, what the fuck? <laughs> on uh, your own show? On your own show? Oh, oh, just at a gig. Yeah, oh, oh, and I was creepy, we screaming, and the audience would just go, and then I went up, Bart Simpson, everyone! <laughs> Lad, I lad, I swear, no one laugh, lad. Oh my god, that is no, really loud. I caramba! <laughs> and I was going, don't have a cow, man. <laughs> don't have a cow, man. I'm waiting for the second. Dress remote like him, just that <laughs> shit. <laughs> no. Oh, that's classic. Just because we were all on the island, Paul, where I bet you won't do that. He was like, oh, oh, that's that. so funny. That don't man. fucking fret me. With the <laughs> 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 I had a great time up there as Bart Simpson. Not my first rodeo, yeah, baby. The, 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 that's when you. That's when you know there's levels of dying in your ass. You're thinking that's when you know you're proper dying in your ass. Is when all you can hear is comedians screaming. Screaming. Well, yeah. the, screaming I'll tell laughing. you what I did to Ken. Yeah, Callum's the way. Callum's uh, the best for uh, Fucking, um, we did tribute festival, tribute band yeah. festival, and on the way there, we was just fucking howling. Every band that came on, we just did a tribute name to it. It's like if Oasis come on, we'd go, "Oh, Vimto are playing," you know. George just dead sit like dead deadpan and like um, stereophonies, just making up daft, daft names yeah. for every band that came on. But we're crying laughing just because how stupid it is. And I went, should do that on stage, you know? It would kill there. He went, do you reckon? <laughs> 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 so he goes on and he, he opens with this he just goes did you see him last night pelvis <laughs> nothing <laughs> and he went, we're as good as the stereo for your knees <laughs> <laughs> and then he's building up to his class and fucking hell two out of two two swings and a miss it was like doing the classic he went I've got one to get me out of shit and he just went not my favourite though what about red red wine from WD40 <laughs> <laughs> and it, I never heard silence get quieter, and I just, I thought I was going to lose a lung. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, he's I'd a fucking man. Man. Did he tell you the bar? Fuck, he's a comfort for that, though. Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? He's the worst person to be with if someone's dying on the ass, because he's so bad. <laughs> like, did you tell you when we, <laughs> we went to Edinburgh for the, I had done a tour show in Glasgow, and we, we were like, 
we'll go to Edinburgh for the night after that. Yeah. No, you were there yeah. with us, weren't you? Yeah, Did you yeah. come into Hayward's gig? Yeah, because you were sat down on the other side of him, weren't you? Fuck me, oh. man. I've never, See, I've is... never fucking. Who was I, it? What's, who I've was never it? not wanted to laugh so much and not being able to stop in my fucking life. You know, Colin Havy. Right? Yeah, one of the nice, oh, dead nice fella, right? Yeah. And it wasn't that his show was bad. His fucking gig was in a karaoke booth, right? His, sh- his show was in a karaoke booth, so we had about 15 people in, right? It's in like the half of the, the size of this room. Really? It was, uh, it was, so we walked in, and he's. But we walked in, and it's me, Blair, him, Callum. It was a Gledo. Yeah, yeah. A few of us, and he's walked, and he's seen Blair and gone, fucking. You know, cause Blair owns hot yeah, water, yeah, so he's gone. Yeah. So that's got in his head a little bit. So he starts off. Well, you know what it's like? Like, it's never going to be a fucking rowdy gig that there's 15 people in, do you know what I mean? Yeah. But he starts off all right. But as soon as there's a moment where, you know, when you say, a, you say a joke and there's a little pause and then the laugh, right? And there's a little tick, you know, and it gets just a second, like half a second past that moment where people should laugh. <laughs> Callum goes, ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm Oh. And he just and so I got to the point where he just couldn't. Every time he said the joke, everyone was just waiting for Callum to laugh and then screaming. And and then Abby's going, well, "He's a cunt, isn't he? He's a cunt. And ignore him because he's a cunt and that." Was he? Was uh, he saying to Callum? Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, don't uh, do but, that. Uh, wait, but we couldn't. So I couldn't one. stop. And he's just carries on the fucking. He gets through the whole show. How long was his show? Fifty An minutes. Right? Fucking hell! It was grim. <laughs> it was fucking grim. And I was gri- I was grabbing Callum's leg. Come, lad, stop it, lad. Stop, stop it. I'm gonna fucking die. I'm gonna Die, I can't. I'm Could he help it, Carlo? No, he's a he's cunt, got, though, went, as well. Isn't yeah, he? Yeah, he, too, yeah, yeah. When he goes, <laughs> when he goes, though, yeah, you know, like so. He's, he's he, he keeps doing it, and then at the end of the show, I'm like, just fucking let him finish his show. And we're like, I'm like, <gasps> trying to breathe, right? And the end of it, I'll never forget it, right? The end because the show is about getting out of debt and turning his life around and all, and it was a dead, like, positive show, right? And at the end of the show, and he goes, Yeah, so I got out of debt, right? and, he out, and he just fucking punched the ceiling so fucking at arm, mate. It was fucking. And, he went, oh. <laughs> <laughs> and everyone just went. Ah! Well, he's like, he's big. Yeah, it's in my oh, <laughs> All these shows just about being dead unlucky. Oh, and mate, I all, swear. all these shows about being dead unlucky in life and loads of shit happening to it. And I'm finally. Now, this is my moment. Bang! <laughs> Do you know what? Don't, oh, hey, couldn't have risked it. It was so like someone had a party. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> them Sundays used to do an envy in there, like the open mics. Like some of the people who got out, mate, like we'd all be at the back, wouldn't we? And like, yeah. it's not being our last, but it's like, it's just funny. It's funny yeah. when you're... It's that little moment, that tension, when the tension gets too much, yeah. you have to fucking so, laugh. Yeah. Yeah. When I'm watching Hello. when I'm watching new acts with Callum, if someone's dying, he just sends me that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You're going to have to cut that in for the, for well, the viewers at that in, yeah. <laughs> Uh, just fucking hilarious. Watching, watching someone struggle with Callum is a fucking yeah, nightmare. He just get he gets too giddy on it. So yeah, but I, I don't know. Was I, anyone used to laugh at me when I struggled? Oh no, no, I've struggled. <laughs> <laughs> That's probably why. <laughs> Except for the comedian of the year, we get last. Oh, what maybe that's such a subject. Like, yeah. Come last, it was fucking bad. We're <laughs> not over that. Last? Day there, he beat you. What? Mm. They come last, last, about last, yeah. I think someone told me to come fourth, just like... There's <laughs> only five happy. on, no. Nah, there's six on. I do remember like it was yesterday, Paul. I do remember like it was yesterday. Yeah, with Adam Rowe, and not he? Adam Rowe's a twin. I look yeah. at him now. Where is he? Look at him now. What's he doing? <laughs> <laughs> He's just best than me and everything, isn't he? Uh, not everything. Not everything. Not smashing bitches. And, yeah, I'm playing footy. I'm better than a footy. Oh, see that Barry? One I take. reckon that'll hurt him, you know. Which? If he is that. Oh, will do. Yeah. He just thinks he's better than me and everything, but he's he not. He knows that's true as well. He, he can't dance like me. <laughs> no. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> every week, love. I used to stop. We used to go out after the gig every week and end up in Pot World and he just challenged ran, st- oh, I, some I, random kids to a fucking dance, dance off, off and, and start going. <laughs> and it just, every week, it went off. Mate, the whole crowd used to surround <laughs> me and this kid who I've saved on the dance floor. Uh, and the uh, man with the mic used to go, everyone, it's the, this that time of the week, Tony Carroll's dance-off. <laughs> and I won like 30 in a row, lad. I was the champion. Hey, we barred. felt like celebrities in there at that point, didn't we? Yeah. Because the only place, no one knew who the fuck we were, but we'd go into Pot World <laughs> and he'd put our names on the screen and that. Yeah, hot talk, water boys hot in water it. Boys <laughs> in it. <laughs> We'd walk oh. like that. Hey. Spit the bar, like. <laughs> <laughs> One of them fucking five pound bottles of Petty fucking Prosecco. <laughs> oh, God. Thinking we were the fucking team. 
We was. We yeah. were fucking better back then. Yeah. Look at us now. I miss it sometimes, me. Was that the envy days, crown days? Mm. Not a care in the world, Jamie. Yeah, I was you ho- about then? Holiday, oh, yeah. you know. You didn't like it, then. You didn't like yeah. Manx, then. Yeah. 18, you know what I mean? You didn't like Manx, <laughs> no. I was being honest with you, mate. <laughs> I like it now. <laughs> <laughs> I was like Banks back then though. Yeah. He was a bit of a divide, wasn't he? Yeah, I'm bringing, I'm bringing peace. I know. Aren't I? Yeah. Fair, I'm like the first nah, one. You like the, first you like, accepted like the one, I think. Nah. First accepted Mank. Nah. Who? Who else? I don't know. I like Brennan, don't we? Yeah, but he's older, me, isn't he? He's, I'm Mank, he's like camp. Do you know what I mean? How oh, is he not Mank now? He's um, what what you'd call Wolves, we'd call a Yonah. A Yonah? Yeah, from like Ashton and. Uh, low mass, are you from yeah. the heart of Manchester, I, Jamie? Heart and soul. Garton, M18. What? <laughs> <laughs> I'd have loved you to start spitting some bars. He <laughs> was lots of politics, though, wasn't he? You, you, yeah. you don't know about me poems, do you? Don't know about your poems, no. Good poems. How good are my poems? I used to send poems into the Tame Side Reporter, Tame Side and Glossop Reporter, and I got in a bit of a poetry beef with this old fella. Because we used to always fight over poem of the week in Poetry Corner in the same side reporter. <laughs> oh, there you go. Mm-hmm. He's telling us yeah. I got what well, mine got nominated for um, Great British Write Off. Did they? Yeah, it's good that. Great didn't, British didn't Write Off. got in the book. Got in the anthology. Published poet. Published poet. Read us the poem, mate. Let me find it. Now. Why have you just said? <sighs> I've got to listen to them all the time. I'll, I'll, I'll goods the uh, the shoe one and the. Um, yeah, brilliant, Jamie. Can I either? See if I can do it just yeah. I'll just try and find it. Um, Doesn't like anyone else reading his own way. What's she, she called her? Anna. What about the lemon lime one? Anna lemon Fletcher. lime. No, it's, it's racial. Oh, is it? Yeah. Lemon lime. <laughs> 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 oh god! <laughs> she got me name. She got me name wrong as well. I got poem of the week for the first time. She called me Richie Jeeves. So, so, so where so so are you then? No. <laughs> <laughs> so you, Some I fucking mean, kid out there called Richie Jeeves. Is oh, it's fuming. There's one about. Do you want to read me lemon and lime one? Yeah. I want to read lemon and lime. There you go. It's called Zest for Life. Like lemon zest. So it's about lemons and limes not getting on, is it basically? Uh, now, there once was a lemon and lime who argued on... <laughs> <laughs> Until one day, the lemon said, Oh, why do we quarrel, my green oval friend? <laughs> I don't know, replied the lime. You drive me round the bend. Five years on, they made up. Before the situation got chronic, they even moved in together in a glass of gin and tonic. Thin. God damn it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it's about like That's published. Racial No, that one's not the published one. I was gonna say. The one about my granddad one was published. I can't find it now. It was fucking good though. Uh I had one about a shoe, didn't I? That was a good yeah, one. Yeah, that was a great one, that Jamie. <laughs> <laughs> I thought these were fucking <laughs> class back in the day. Oh. Well, so, so it's about your granddad? No, uh, oh, I can't find it. Granddad. My dad's dad. No. <laughs> His <I'll>... dad's dad. That's so funny. <laughs> oh, I'll have to find it for next time. It was, uh, it's, it's, I used, oh my God, I found loads here. Sorry. Uh, Fuck sake. Well, <laughs> sorry. There'll be some Bastards. fucking editing just, in this podcast. No, I'm just, I'm just like having flashbacks. Oh. You're just reading your emails oh. there, aren't you? <laughs> just catching no. one of your emails. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm just, I'm remembering some of the names. What happened to Lottie Lockhart? Fucking hell. You're a weird guy, aren't you? Yeah, I can't, I can't, remember, I can't remember that one. Sorry, right, Jack. Oh, I found the granddad one. This is pup. This is this, is, this is the pup. Yeah, you got to give it a bit of. I'll give it some payfast, don't we, anyway? Yeah, it's it's payfast, lad. Let's get this. It's got to be better than mine. Let's wait till it loads. Just seen an email here. Fucking fifteen minute gigs there. 
Fucking up, upstairs, talking. Spanky, mate. Get league off. 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 Get if you want to hear the granddad poem, join the members. I'll do it um, on the members. It'll be on members only as a special edition bit of bonus content where I will perform live, granddad, <laughs> by Richie G. <laughs> <laughs> I emailed back because it's just before I did stand up, so I was getting into, you know, creativity <laughs> and that. And, yeah. um, and she said, she put me in as Richie Jeeves. So I thought, <laughs> it's a good name. I might have it for my stage name. But no, seriously, it's uh, Jamie Hutchinson. Can you. Uh, Amend that because I've told everyone I've got poem of the week and no one believes me. I think you should have gone with Richie Jeeves, you know. Sounds good, doesn't mm-hmm. it? It is a good name. Isn't Rolls it? off the tongue a bit better, Richie Jeeves. Oh, also. it's loaded. Oh, yeah. Oh, like, oh, oh. oh well. <coughs> <laughs> oh, fuck, it's loaded. Poem with two M's. <laughs> it's a silent M. <laughs> it's he a spelled, silent M. He spelled poem wrong. This is a published poet. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> granddad. Hard working bloke, never on the old rock and roll. My granddad, I'm sure he's looking down on me. Charisma king with a northern soul. <laughs> <laughs> Footy snooker and a cheeky pint or two. My granddad, I'm sure he's looking down on me. A family of extroverts, of which he's the glue. <laughs> All congregate to God. This is my soul. Oh, I know, I'm trying not to be honorable about it though. It's weird. I'm back in fucking Colin Avery's show here. Yeah. <laughs> 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 all congregate to Grand's house. Ten grandkids, all excitable and loud. My, grand, my granddad, I'm sure he's looking down on me. I guess I'll try and make him proud. Oh. He met my gran in the old da- town dance. By all accounts, <laughs> by all accounts, he was quite a nut. <laughs> no way. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he can't be arsed anymore. <laughs> it doesn't say that. It doesn't say that, but I have to say. <laughs> <laughs> He met my gran at the old town dance. By all accounts, he was quite the groover. <laughs> my granddad, I'm sure he's looking down at me. He's not dead. He's just the roofer. <laughs> the roofy boys. <laughs> the roofy boys. It's in my blood. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. Oh, my head's in bits here. That was amazing. <laughs> that was fucking amazing. Great British right off 2014. What? Do you know what? Oh. Sign up for YouTube members now. Three pound a month. Small poems. I'll do the little. price of that. You get fucking content like fucking Jamie Hutchinson, Richie G's fucking poetry <laughs> specials, mate. Why wouldn't you want to oh. sign up for that? Why wouldn't you want to sign up for that? Oh, fucking hell. Sign up. I'll throw oh. that coffee right up right now and take it back and give you three quid. There you go. <laughs> Fuck, I can't believe I used to do that, you know. Oh, no excuse, yeah. I was 24. <laughs> <laughs> it's because, uh, right, I was writing a newsletter for the Tameside Health and Wellbeing team. Yeah. So I was doing, like, you know, promoting Pilates classes and stuff. But I was trying to make them funny. So I, I'd made everything rhyme in this newsletter, you know, about Pilates or f- f- Slimming World and stuff like that. So I was going, oh, you're dead good at that. You know, just getting like a pat on the head off your manager. So I went, oh, I'll start writing poems into the local paper. <laughs> I used, done, to, I used I've... to write love poems. Aww. Yeah. Like to girls when I was younger. But not like that. Well, nah, the woman has said... done as well. I've wrote I, some poems. I wrote, a love po- I wrote a love poem to a girl by ours, yeah. Like, lives around the corner for me. And I put her under, like, a letterbox in her. And I found it, didn't I? Oh, no. Yeah, and read it out in front of everyone. Shag a dad. 
Nah, just <laughs> sad at me for like, you're still sad as me now. <laughs> oh, hold it, you need it. Well, I was about to... Nah, there's nothing to oh. I go to the shop and I only go, ah, hey, remember you wrote that poem? Hey, I got ghosted off a love letter. Oh, yeah. Right. I met a girl on MSN chat, right? It was about 13. And we started writing letters to each other. How old was you then? 13. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Not taking after this granddad. <laughs> That's about the old school dance. <laughs> he was bad. I had <laughs> Do not serve this man at the old town dance. I met this girl at the old town dance. Oh I looked down and I had no pants. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we told the. You must have by now. Which? We told the Luke Montague story. Uh, on another pod. Yeah, I'll have you. Not on another pod. Well, go and find that guy. Ah, you muppets. God for me, bro. Yeah, fuck you, boys. <laughs> uh, I told her on um, on another podcast. Oh, sad. But, you know. What's that? What happened there? Uh, did you see it on How I Word? I've seen oh, was it on now, was it? my episode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They like the Simpsons. Simpsons. Are they like the Simpsons now, are they? They just, every, every story's being done. Yeah, pretty much. Have a yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, but we might have new fans. But you know what? They haven't got poetry. Where do we the poetry slams? Yeah, yeah. Baby. Basically, an abridged version is he lent Luke Montague his granddad's suit. Oh, suit. yeah. And then Luke Montague uh-huh. gave him a back without the pants and said he lost the pants. Yeah. And then oh. uh, two months later, turned up with a gig and had his granddad's pants. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, he robbed me granddad's pants. He robbed... How can you rob the pants? <laughs> I don't get that. But why wouldn't you just rob the whole suit if you're going to go for that guy? <laughs> that's why. Mm. I haven't you seen him since. Oh, I don't right. think he's very happy because he told the story. Like, but you know I what? Mean, listen, don't fucking I, rob, I, don't I, I was being a nice guy to him. Yeah. I was being a nice guy by lending him pants. And he fucking robbed him. Oh, that's so, a nude lending pants, isn't it? What do you expect me to do? <sighs> Not tell a story? <laughs> I'd Not, tell a story. What do you think I'd tell my granddad, Luke? My poor granddad's sitting here now with no pants on because of you. Because you stole my granddad's pants. Yeah. So he's sitting there and he's like, oh, I've got no pants on. I'm in my granddad's pants now. <laughs> <laughs> Roofy boys, we are here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're getting... You're not reading none of my poems. Have you got a poem, have you? Oh, yeah. Oh, I'd love, oh. I'd love to hear one yeah. of Paul Smith's poems. Yeah. So backfired Lovely everyone. wife to yeah. be. <laughs> The quill's in the other hand now, isn't it? <laughs> hey, come on, Paul. Well, mine, to be fair, mine, I love poems. Yeah, I'd love it's to. Very I, you know what? I'd, I'd lo- yeah. I thought you were in here. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking slag. Okay, I'll read it, because uh, I've got like a love, a love voice. Yeah, I've got a love vibe. Give us some bass, lad. <clears throat> I always see you. <laughs> fucking Barry <laughs> Wyatt. <What? laughs> I always Did see I? you. I always see you. you me, no, never. Paul, excuse me. Don't Sorry, interrupt, please. I'm I, I, I keep talking when I'm embarrassed. Right, guys, get tucked in, because, hey, and also make sure there's some paper towels by you, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> wanking. I always see you. You may think that I don't see you when distractions take my mind or I take your feelings lightly <laughs> and my words can be unkind. <laughs> you still marrying him? Oh! <laughs> 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 I can't say that! <laughs> I can't even that. Three weeks, man. I see you. Sometimes you might think I don't see you, but I do see you. <laughs> that, is, that, have... that is fucking weird, that <laughs> lad. That means like he's stalking. Can they give them a fucking good one? <laughs> nah, I like this one. I'll start again, eh? <clears throat> I always see you. You may think that I don't see you. <laughs> but distractions take my mind, or I take your feelings lightly, and my words can be unkind. But I always see you really, not always eyes but always heart. I see our true connection, together or apart. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so now that if I ever make you feel like I don't see the things you find important, grey and care or quirky dreams, just know I always see you. <laughs> In every thought I have, the way you take no shit from me, the way you make me laugh. I see eyes that see me whole. I see lips that speak the truth. I see deep into your soul. I always see you. I mean, that's fucking better than all yours. <laughs> <laughs> How many poems of the week have you on the same side report? This is what I want. I, I want this in my life. Jesus, <laughs> <laughs> this is Dust. what I want in my life. I need this. Paul, that was beautiful. Thank you, mate. I, I think Jamie got girl, threatened. You know, you're a very lovely girl. I think, I think you're a bit threatening. 
Have you got one for him? Oh, I'd love to read. Oh, you can read this one out. You can be the, you can you can be be the be female. Lonely. Do a Brummie accent. What? Do a Brummie accent. Right. You can be the female. No. <laughs> <laughs> right then. Yeah. Give you some fucking you power as well. I might show you know, upstairs talking. Hey, make sure you do the eyes as well. Yeah. The eyes. Oh. Yeah. Not to me, to the cameras. Oh. Yeah. We should have saved this for our own podcast. No. Oh. <laughs> Funny guy. By Larry Callow. <clears throat> they call you funny guy. They call you king. They say you're the future of comedy, even though you're ginge. <laughs> <laughs> they love a Snapchat selfie. They love an Insta mention. They send you tits and free shit just to get your attention. They want more stories. They want more jokes. They like you saying you ain't a grass when the lad up front does loads of coke. <laughs> but the man behind the laughter, the piss takes and the show is a man who is the kindest, most beautiful soul I know. And you're a nonce. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful, oh, that Laurie. Sure. I think that. Laurie wins that one. Oh, your wed- your the wedding's gonna get emotional, isn't it? Then yeah, it's gonna be some fucking, it's gonna be like a, ro- uh, a rap battle. So it's be like, you know, don't flop. Do you want to do my granddad one at your wedding? You're not coming. <laughs> I'll do. I'll You're make not allowed at the wedding. By Zoom. Why is Jamie allowed to win? Because he's. Have you uh, seen? Lie, have you seen away. Jamie when he's had a pint? <laughs> he's a fucking. Disgrace. Yeah, I've only be. I've. We've only play. Like, he only... looks lost. He has one pint and looks homeless. He's like fucking Barney from The Simpsons. It's fucking grim. <laughs> <laughs> Bit. It's so true, yeah. though, isn't it? Now I realise. Fucking mad. Why did you just go all that droopy when you had one bite? It's fucking gets off with your fucking drugs, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I ripped an hole in the bag. It had to be done. Oh, I thought that was mine. How oh, sound, Jay? Nice, I love you. And I fucking <laughs> level you out, you cunt. Oh, yeah, my granddad was looking down on me. <laughs> <laughs> That's the whole point of the poem. He's looking down at me. It's not that he's a roofer because he was a roofer. Yeah, we know we got it. Yeah, he, he, no, di- no. he died. Though. We got we got the, the imagery. Yeah. yeah, he fell off a roof. Good, yeah. So, so was, your, was your granddad Roddle? <laughs> 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 my <Me> grand's Amy. <laughs> <laughs> so, Paul, <laughs> the next topic we want to finish on. It's oh. the big day soon. Yeah, the big day. Are you looking yeah. forward to it? I am. Yeah, I am. Excited. I am. It's going to be a special occasion. I just wasn't... No, you were nice. That was nice, though. Thank you. I feel like you were sincere. I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be... I just just don't like it's so far away, isn't it? Just thinking, like... Oh, because it's far in distance away? Yeah, it's pretty far, isn't it? So I was just thinking, you know, like... I'm going to have to bring a plus one, aren't I? You know, to keep me entertained. Well, we can't, (laughs) now. What? We can't now. But I've already RSVP'd a plus one. Have you? Yeah, yeah. So, that plus one. Has yeah. he? I'm... Me in a wig? I don't think he has. Has I have. He? I have. Yeah, I have, Defo. I don't know. Pay... Uh, uh, no, was... But who are you bringing? I was going to bring an escort, yeah. <laughs> but, but, I, now, listen, I, listen, I don't, listen, I understand. Like, yeah, I, can bring I don't know what he's going to be here, yeah. So but you're we'll... in control, you're in charge of him. Right, no, wait, hang on, I'm, no, hang on, wait there, you'll have to do something for me to get me your plus one. <laughs> <laughs> Paul, to the wig, like... biggest wedding of the year. But listen, I was going to be, me and Adam, right, me and Adam were going to bring escorts, right, just, <clears> but then I thought, no, you can't, just tacky on, you know, on your mate's yeah, wedding yeah. day, I understand, but would have been boss, me and Adam got, like, proper, like, high-end escorts, not, like, Sheila Road ones, I mean, like, fucking high-end ones, and me and Adam just walked in with these, like, supermodels, would have been sick, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would have been sick for about a minute until everyone went, why are you two with escorts? <laughs> <laughs> because <laughs> we all know yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh. And, uh, and, and these two fucking Russian billionaire fucking yeah they can't even speak like, English yeah. <laughs> like that how do you meet really? Tony just like pay me who's Tony <laughs> <laughs> pay me <laughs> what you mean fat man <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even coming. <laughs> yeah, you you can have a plus. You can have my plus one. I'll come with a shield road one. <laughs> <laughs> hey, and everyone like, how the fuck have you got it? <laughs> and everyone like, see James, hey, she, teeth in her head. Hey, James, new beard, sound, isn't she? He's fucking done alright for himself. Hey, I feel like he's getting his shit together. <laughs> <laughs> Class that. 
<laughs> them poems are working, you know. Oh yeah, that's actually yeah, might meet some of the weather. Some of yeah. follow. Yeah, there's Who loads knows? of eligible. Yeah. Well, your, your, me and your younger brother, we've got a plan, you see, before they've been speaking. So, yeah, we're gonna, you know, go yeah, on. Jack will sort you out. Yeah, we say we're gonna go on the pull there. So, mm. yeah. Well, the roofy boys are name and nature. So you're gonna let it? You're gonna have to let Jack have like the first five. Well, yeah, he's a handsome cunt. He's <laughs> fucking yeah, I know. But I think we make a good duo. I think. Yeah, I've I got the he cab, would. but he's got the looks. Sort you, out, hey. you know what I mean? Yeah, I've got the dance moves. Yeah. No one can take that away from me, mate. No, no, no mate. Billy Elliot, that was based on me. <laughs> <laughs> Just want to dance. <laughs> Play football or wrestling. <laughs> I just want to dance, Dad. I just want to dance, Dad. <sighs> but yeah, it's been a, it's, it's been, been a, good. This it's, it's been, been a pleasure. Enjoy myself. Do you know what? I was going to say, Paul. We, we we like to get people relaxed on the. It's a green room mm. podcast. You know, you just want you to feel nice and relaxed before you go on stage mm. now and fucking smash it, mate. Mm. And I which feel like I'm in a good do. space now, yeah. Go sure what I mean? Gig, no. That's what we do. Mm. Oh, we've got another gig. We've got, yeah. I'm going to watch some of the show. Oh, are yeah. you doing mm. another one of these tonight, are you? Yeah. yeah. Um, but I'm going to drop in and watch some stand up as well. Oh, uh, yeah. In between. Yeah, yeah, I've got nothing to do after this, so yeah, yeah. I'll just wait for you, Jamie. <laughs> my other, my other pint. I try, I try not to. I'm going to stay off the ale, look, see? Yeah. I haven't had a drink, yes? Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm having a bevy. Should we have a bevy? Yeah, well, yeah. I'm a bit self conscious about me, Barney Rumble. Right, we, now. we haven't got to day seven again this week, but I promise you, I'm getting better. So next week, maybe we'll get to the seven day badge. Oh, and just to let you know, I'm putting on a couple of work in progress shows in um, autumn, hopefully. Hopefully, one at Hot Water, if Binti will have me. I've not asked him yet, but I'm just going to socially pressure him. Um, and one in Manchester, probably Gulliver's, or two in Manchester, because it's only a small room. Um, so keep your eyes peeled and buy tickets so that's what I look like a little nabbed. Yeah. A little whip, a little whip from the Paul, Is there anything you want to promote or is there anything you want to say about us? Any kind uh, of words? Go and see these two because they're two of the best comedians in the country and they're two of my favourites. And if I had to pick a line up, thank you, Paul. For lovely it. words. Well, I mean that. I'm not even just saying that because I'm sat here and they're both looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> where can people find you, mate? Everyone knows where you are. Paul is in um, is it? At Hot Water yeah. Comedy Club. Um, on the What's the Story Paul and Lori podcast, which is back soon in the new studio. Exclusive. Um, yeah, so that'll be back soon. Boss. And uh, yeah, just on, on Instagram and that. Sweet, Tony. Sorry, Tony, where can they find you, mate? Um, I don't want to say this no. week. Yeah. Find, find him. Tony if you love Cattle, him, find 14. him. Tony Cannell, 14, Instagram, Twitter. Follow your heart. Tony's at the end. <laughs> That's a lovely one. beautiful again, Paul. What a beautiful ending. Thanks, for, thanks for coming down, mate. <laughs> Tony's going to be like I object to this when <laughs> full, full dressed in drag <laughs> let me be the fairy tale and then we all realise do you see me now cult. do you see me <laughs> see me Paul see my feelings do you see me even though I see you sometimes and I might see you you don't see me shite granddad's better uh, <laughs> this podcast is dedicated to my granddad may he nonce in heaven Yay!